I appreciate you joining. I hope that you are doing well. Clean and purify water the ancient way. Seeds from the Moringa tree provide an expensive water purification. Clean water is essential for good health. In many countries, it is still difficult to obtain clean water. In addition, purifying water can be expensive and cumbersome, using harsh chemicals to treat the water. Even developed countries can benefit from a process that treats wastewater without addition of further synthetic chemicals. While researchers were learning of ways to clean water in developing nations, they stumbled on a safer method, tried and true. The Ancient Egyptian Way Women in ancient Egypt reportedly rubbed moringa seeds on their clay water pots, and dried powder from crushed seeds has been used as a hand wash for many years. In ancient Egypt, people used the crushed seeds of the moringa oleifera tree to clear up cloudy water. Scientists later discovered that a protein in the seeds kills bacteria by gathering them into clusters which sink to the bottom of the container. Researchers at Penn State announced that they'd solved a piece of the puzzle, how the protein kills the bacteria. It seems to fuse the membranes of the bacteria together. Membranes are designed to protect a cell, so when those defenses are breached, it's bad news for the bacteria. One of the biggest challenges in using Moringa seeds for cleaning water is that people don't know which seeds work and don't work. This is a problem because if people use the wrong seeds, they will think their water is clean, when in fact it's not. So the researchers teamed up with a botanist from a university in Nigeria. The botanist brought four kinds of seeds of different maturity levels and harvest times from Nigeria to Penn State. The researchers then studied their mass, oil content, and ability to kill bacteria and clarify water. They found that the extracted protein of mature dried seeds collected in the rainy season were most effective, followed by mature dried seeds collected in the dry season. Instructions on how to purify water with Moringa seed pods. Number one, collect only mature Moringa seed pods and remove the seed from its casing. Number two, shell seeds. Remove seed coat to obtain clean seed kernels Discard discolored seeds. Number three, determine the number of seed kernels you will need based on the turbidity and volume of water to be purified. In general, one seed kernel will treat a liter of water. Water with high turbidity, dirt, and microorganisms may need more seeds. Number four, crush the seed kernels using a mortar and pestle to obtain a fine powder and sift the powder through a screen or small mesh. Number five, mix the seed powder with clean water to form a paste. Number six, mix the paste in about one cup of clean water in a bottle. Shake the bottle for one minute to activate the coagulant properties and form a solution. Number seven, filter this solution through a muslin cloth or fine mesh screen and into the water to be treated. Number eight, Stir the water rapidly for about one minute, and then slowly for approximately 10 minutes. Number nine, let the water sit undisturbed for at least one to two hours. Number 10, carefully pour clean water from the top. The contaminants will have settled to the bottom. Number 11, this clean water can then be filtered or sterilized for use in cooking or drinking. Please note, the process of shaking and stirring must be followed closely to activate the coagulant properties, or secondary bacterial growth may occur. In addition, Moringa does not remove all water pathogens, just a large percentage. Eventually, scientists hope that the seeds can be grown and harvested in areas where they are most needed. Other parts of the plant are edible making it useful for not only cleaning water, but providing a nutritious source of food for communities. Thank you for watching. Good day and good health.